plans and progress. Uh, our role as physical planning officers, we plan land, for example, identifying for identify land for project for government uh, day out and the like. But I do have some fair knowledge about uh, Babylon, as you rightly said, because we worked on it uh, years back when there was this dispute. As I said, the dispute is between the villagers, uh, different villages anyway. Uh, our role there is not very uh, radical great. We don't have much participation in it. But what we did was we just prepared a plan for them when they requested for it, and then we gave them the plan. We had a series of meetings with them. Mm -hmm. yeah. So, who is the owner of the land, the Babylon Makumbaya land that has been said there are a lot of issues. The people of Makumbaya are claiming to own that land and the people of Babylon are also saying they are the owner of that land. No, I, you know, I said, I said if you uh, well, if you had uh, heard my uh, deliberation, I said we don't involve ourselves in land ownership, the Department of Physical Planning and Housing. What they are saying, Makumba said it, it is their land. Uh, well, Babylon people also say, and other villages, Mandinaring, Lamen, we have about four or five uh, people who are saying the land belongs to them. But as a department, we cannot say that land belongs to Makumba or it belongs to Babylon. Okay. So who is responsible, if I may ask? Who should we ask? No, land, land uh, as I said, land uh, ownership is not determined by our department. Uh, Normally, it should be the Department of Land and Service, the, the next uh, door of the I mean, department. But they too have their limitations. Because when you come to the ownership, as I said, it cannot be determined by us. We, what we are responsible is the administration of land, how land is administered. But who actually own it, we cannot say. What I know, one thing I know is that land between Combo, North, South, and East, were declared as state land way back in March 1994. That's mm -hmm. what I know. And uh, which means the ownership should just on the state. But whether the state is taking that responsibility or not, well, that, that's, uh, that, that's uh, a concern anyway. Mm -hmm. um, so recently we have seen a lot of people have been accusing um, your ministry, your department, that you, know, you have been the cause of all these land issues. What can you say? Uh, I, I think those are baseless. Uh, if you are listening to our uh, press conference, uh, mm -hmm. it was stated there, our participation or involvement in that administration. Uh, I stated, I told you, government has declared some areas within uh, Combo. Well, well, let me say, they have declared Combo North, South, and the East as in March 1994. And then in 19, before that, 1991, we prepare our acts, different acts governing land law. So the fact that government has declared these areas as state land, government can go in those areas, acquire lands for public use or for other uses which the government thinks is necessary. So this is how we uh, do the land management, this is how we go to the land. And if we feel that government needs these areas for public use, think of the kind of things. The Pajaras, the Bruce Bees, all were acquired by the state to be used by the public for public 